This is a bowl with a decoration of an insect by Emile Gallet. It's called a dragonfly. He was apprenticed in his father's factory where his father produced decorative glass and ceramics. Gallet apprenticed there and eventually took over the business and not only made it a successful business, but turned the manufacture of art glass in Nancy into a flourishing industry. Gallet was not just a smart businessman, however. He was also a poet, and he was a passionate horticulturalist. You can see in the painting shown of Gallet in this case that he is shown with plants and trees around him and the kind of impassioned activity of designing one of his vases. The quote that you see next to it that says, our roots are in the depths of the woods, on the edge of the springs, on the mosses. That was inscribed on the doors of his studio. So Gallet was very much enamored of and in love with the natural world. And you'll see on this dragonfly coop, he used a kind of decoration that was fairly scandalous for the time, a huge insect. What would make Gallet think that an insect, especially a dragonfly, which can be kind of scary when they get large, be such an interesting topic for a vase? But this is what Gallet's work was about. It was about looking at the natural world and bringing the beauty of the natural world into glass in all kinds of ways. So not only did he look at insects, but also at trees and flowers. And we can see this interest in the natural world throughout his work. These vases are characteristic of a style that we call Art Nouveau, which means new art in French. It is very typical of the turn of the century. You have Art Nouveau coming into fashion about 1880 and going out of fashion right at the beginning of World War I in 1914. The characteristics of the Art Nouveau style are the interest in the natural world, an elegant flowing curves that you see throughout the decoration, and also an interest in all different kinds of colors and techniques. 